Remembering the Types of Triangles You're with Mr. Rossi and today we're answering this question. How do we remember the names of the different types of triangles? First of all, the equilateral triangle. Equilateral has equal at the beginning. And equal means the same. An equilateral triangle has all of its sides the same, same length. We can show it like this. It also has all of its angles equal or the same. Scalene triangle. Scalene sounds a little bit like scaly to me. And when I think of scaly, I think of ugly. Bullies often bully people because they're different in some way. Maybe it's because they are ugly. The scalene triangle is different in every way. It's different because all of its sides are different. This side is a different length to this side, and this side is different to the others. So they're all different. The longest one is this one, and the shortest one is this one, and this one is in between. So the sides are all different, and the angles are also all different. So this is the smallest angle. This one here looks like it's nearly about 90 degrees. And this one here looks a little bit smaller than an L shape. So they're all different sized angles as well. So it's very ugly, very scaly, so scalene. Isosceles triangle. An isosceles triangle is a triangle with two sides that are the same. Sometimes it's obvious. You can look at the triangle and you can see which two sides are the same. Like with this triangle here, we can see that, that these two sides are the same and we can show it by putting these little marks here. So by putting an identical mark it means they are the same size. We can see they're the same and this one here is at the bottom is different because it is longer. This isosceles triangle we can see that these two sides are the same and the bottom one is different, it's much shorter. Sometimes it's hard to tell that it's an isosceles triangle. It may look more like an equilateral triangle that we saw previously. But we know that this is an isosceles triangle because it has these two identical marks telling us that these, these two sides are the same length. So this one here must be a little bit longer or a little bit shorter. So all of these triangles are isosceles. Now to help us remember that, think of I in isosceles and think of how many eyes do you have? Well, you have two eyes. So then think of isosceles means two sides are the same. And that also means there'll be two angles the same. Like these two here are the same. These two here are the same. And if we follow these two lines down, which are the same, then we know that one is the same as this one. Right angled triangle. A right angled triangle has a right angle in one of the corners of the triangle. To know that it is in a right angled triangle, there will normally be this little square in the corner. So we know that it is a right angled triangle. A right angled triangle can also be scalene, like this one. All the sides here are different. This is the longest, and then this one is the next longest, and this one is the shortest. So all the sides are different, so it's scalene, but it's also a right angled triangle. This one is similar because it is also scalene. 
this one here is the longest this one here is a little bit shorter and this one here is the shortest so it's scalene because all the sides are different but it's also a right angle triangle because it has a right angle here in the corner or an upside down L shape this one here is a right angle triangle but it's also an isosceles triangle and that's because it has these two identical marks meaning these two sides are the same so it is an isosceles triangle and it's also a right angle triangle now at this point you might like to pause the video and see if you can work out how many of these triangles can you name now okay so let's see if you are correct the first one let's have a look at the sides and it looks like the sides are all different because this is the longer side this one is a little bit shorter and this one is the shortest so if all the sides are the different are different and that means all the angles would be different as well on the inside here then it is a scalene triangle the second one has a right angle in the corner so it is a right angled triangle number three we can see it has two marks here which are the same so these two sides are the same what do you call that an isosceles triangle and finally it has this triangle number four has three marks which are all the same the same mark so that means all these sides are the same and that is an equilateral triangle